And this is a day in Burlington decades in the making as Amtrak officially arrives, launching expanded service on the Ethan Allen line through Virgins and Middlebury all the way to the Big Apple. But as Local 22's Dana Casulo shows us, not everything has gone as planned for the debut ride. While the celebration went off without a hitch, potential trouble down the tracks meant that the run of the expanded Ethan Allen Express faced some delays. More on that in a moment. First, the ceremony here in Burlington. Friday morning, Burlington sent off its first train. <laughs> Filled with passengers, all on a different journey. I've been looking forward to the uh, Ethan Allen being extended to Burlington for many, many years. Josh Farber has loved train travel his whole life. It's relaxing. It's a completely different frame of mind. Um, it's more social. It's a more relaxing pace and great scenery. Marie Lawrence Haytu is on her way to visit her boyfriend in New York City. Being in a long distance relationship, a train makes it much more easier because when I'm going to get there, I'm going to be so refreshed and very relaxed about the traveling. A ceremony was held at Burlington's Union Station to celebrate the occasion. In attendance was Governor Phil Scott, Mayor Moreau Weinberger, and Senator Bernie Sanders. If today is about anything, it suggests the Vermonters are persistent. It's only been several decades. The last time there was a direct train service from Burlington to New York was in 1953. Mayor Weinberger believes it will have a positive effect on the economy. A void left in our cities downtown has now been filled. This restored service will give a much needed boost to our downtown at a key time. And travelers now have a new lower carbon connection to New York City. As for Marie Lawrence Hay too, the price is worth every penny. Taking a train from Burlington to New York City will make uh, obviously the, like, the traveling much more easier. Uh, you don't get the fatigue of driving and then you don't have to find parking downtown New York City. Now the issue in Albany, concerns about a hazardous building near the tracks meant a temporary halt to service into New York's capital. The train will terminate in Schenectady. Passengers will be bused to Albany and continue to journey to New York City. Reporting in Burlington, Dana Casulo, Local 22 News.